four of four to start. So a nice offensive rhythm to start here. Inside, Brunson. And the officials call goaltending, so they'll award the basket. Yeah, that's a very close call. I'm Nobody sure he team. thinks it's a clean block, but looks like it was on the way down. And timeout is called by Charles Lee. He wants to talk to his guys. Well, let's take a look at last year's top scores. The fourth spot held by Jalen Brunson. And looking back, his points per game really underscored the fact that he never took a game off. I mean, one special performance after another all season long. First quarter of basketball, just over two and a half minutes played. Virginia Beach needs to get off a shot here. And he comes up with the deuce. Shooting four or five to start the game. That's got to be a feel good. Here's DiVincenzo. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. Yeah, complete focus right now. Such an impressive start to this game. 100% from the field. And it's blocked. And they hit it back. Here's Milton. And he converts the lane. And that's a lesson for the D. Fight harder on the glass. Yeah, you just can't afford to give up second chance opportunities again and again. Now, here's DiVincenzo. He had 15 points last out. Now, here's Ananobi. He's tightly guarded. Buries it from three-point range. Brunson's got eight points. Ah, the lefty Brunson with a sweet three-stroke. Let's it go. And there's Virginia Beach with another bucket. And he is really in a zone right now, playing and scoring with confidence. Pass to DiVincenzo. The three. And the Knicks hit again from deep. Assists like that have typified their effort today. Terrific ball move. Puts it up. And they cash in right away with the quick shot. Nine points in the game so far. And his presence as a scorer, it, it just has a calming effect for the rest of the team. He's a fallback option whenever they need him. Now here's Brunson. Coming off a stellar performance against Boston. And there's the foul on the shot. He'll go to the line for two. And you know what? Very close to a three-point play right there. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for the Knicks. They look to fire as much as possible from outside the arc, and so far they are hitting at a high clip. So much good energy and flow tonight, and that has really come out a great ball movement. Guys have been open, and as soon as they are, they get the ball. I like their focus coming in. Terrific execution so far. Well, if there were four or five boxes to check in terms of the game plan tonight, they might have checked six. I mean, they're doing everything out there. Pass to Milton. And he comes it down. And I gotta say, sort of surprising he goes for a slam that difficult when they're trailing. Mm -hmm, but, but still, a magnificent move to the rim. And great camera work showing up on the AT&T 5G Slam King. And here's Brunson. He'll bring it up for the New York Knicks. They're leading by eight. Their last game, a win against Boston. Looking to carry it into this one. Yeah, mental toughness on the road. The arena was rocking, but they just got down to business and never let up. Impressive to see them on the road just step up and have that kind of offensive performance. And so it's Charles Lee calling timeout. He wants to make some adjustments to the game plan, clearly. Virginia Beach trails by 10. Virginia Beach, First their second and third free throws tonight. And one of the highlights last year for this group was the fact that they were so efficient from the charity strike. That's a huge factor. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Now you can tell he's feeling confident right now at the line, and when he's on, he can be lights out. Miracle man, the pass to Bridges. Here's the profit. Back to Bridges. And it's blocked. Out of bounds, 
Knicks ball as New York keeps possession. Miles McBride's checked in for Jalen Brunson. Number two, Miles McBride. Pass to McBride. Six to shoot. Takes a three. With the clock winding down. And that one is stuck right through. That's what he gives you. A big time presence on the glass. And you know what, Greg? Once he gets his hands on it, he's not even thinking about kicking it out. Oh, his competitiveness right now is why the teammates love him. They recover it. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. So far, both teams scorching the nets. You gotta love it. Yeah, made for TV game here. Pace is great. Scoring is coming in bunches. And both of the teams feeling confident right now. Josh Hart, he's checked in for New York. Jalen Brunson comes in for Miles McBride. Just too hard. Brunson outside. Yes, once again, it remains perfect. Six attempts and six hits. He's got a lot to do with the position that they're in. A very smart offensive performance tonight from him. Here's the prodigy. Here's Miracle Man. He really was a guy who also stepped up in that game against the Celtics. Bridges kicks to Hart. Number one. New York shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. And if we want to take a look back, they converted about 76% from the line. Two shots. He hits both from the strike. I mean, drawing fouls and making them pay at the line. Hard against Milton. Pass to the professor. And that one drops for him. And really, it's been a major aspect of their offense in the early stages here. Their success working the ball inside and getting points from close range. Ball's not loose. And here's the fast break. Virginia Beach working the ball around now. His second shot goes in. Off to a good start. Two for two. I think he wanted to shoot that ball, but you see your teammate wide open. Be a good teammate. Make the delivery. Nice pass. Nice catch and a resounding dunk. Pushing the action, getting others involved. He does it time and time again. Nice to play with a point guard that takes pride in playmaking and makes you move around just a little bit faster to get open spots. And when he breaks out the crossover, you can be sure he's going to leave somebody in his way. And Brunson, here we go. It's tipped. Here's the professor, defended by Bridges. Here's the professor to the right side. There will be two minutes to the And indeed, the they're going to look at it again. They need to be certain he beat the buzzer. The shot. And even though. You know, you're thinking maybe we don't need the replay in a situation like this. Still plenty of time left in this game, and really it's about getting the call right. A free-flowing first quarter. And hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. Halfway through the first half in this one. And looking at what we've seen from the Knicks so far, what do you guys think? In that first period, they showed a willingness to make the extra pass. Well, so much unselfish play out there. The coaching staff has to be thrilled with that. Randall and Robinson hold down the post for him. Bridges out there with Jalen Brunson. And it's hard in at the three slot. They're the group New York will start the second one. For Virginia Beach, they've yet to miss from the free throw line. They're three for three. Brunson outside. Brunson downhill, banked in off the glass. Brunson's got 17. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. Brent, when you survey Jalen Brunson, going from role player now to all-star, what a rise. What's been the key for him? I just think it's confidence, Kevin. It's simple confidence. I don't think there's one point where Jalen Brunson didn't believe 
that not that he was the best player on the court, but that he was going to be the best leader. And that has translated into him producing some massive scoring and assist nights for any team that he's played on. This guy is a winner. Milton against Hart. That one's in there. The next lead is cut to just three points on the basket for Milton. And they've repeatedly probed inside in the first half, guys, and, and it's paid off. Robinson kicks to Randall. Back to Robinson. Pass to Randall. Just five to shoot. Beat the shot clock, but it's off the mark. And that was almost a block. Still did enough to alter the shot. Yeah, altering the shot just as long as there's a miss, that kind of energy not wasted. That evens the score. He's got eight. It does so much out there to stretch out the defense when he's out on the perimeter and he drains the triple. And Tom Thibodeau decides to call timeout. He wants to check in with his team and regroup. At this break in the action, we can show you the teams that had the most rebounds last season. They, they had such a strong presence. In the paint, just a physical team. They dominated the interior in terms of rebound. Well, they shouldn't be giving that shot to anyone, but they certainly shouldn't be giving it to him. That's a big break for the defense. Robinson with the block. Such good instincts from Robinson there to throw that one away. Even Genzo against Milton. Brunson. Left side. Pretty bucket inside by Brunson. And here in the second quarter of action with a hair under two and a half minutes played so far. And there's Virginia Beach with another bucket. And boy, he's really in a groove. Dominant performance last game. Same thing this time out. Seems to be nobody standing in his way. No roadblocks for him to get to his spot, capitalize, and continue to be aggressive. Let's check in with our reporter, David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. Jalen Brunson is a very cerebral player. He says he focuses on the little things. The attention to detail has made the game a lot easier. I know what I'm capable of. So as long as I keep working on my craft, keep the same mindset, only good things are going to happen for me. Kevin, back to you. Good stuff, David. Amazing how far he has come. We appreciate the report. Pulls it up. Offline from the top of the key. For Virginia Beach, they've gotten all but one of their seven shots in the second quarter to drop. Pretty impressive. What a jam! Wow, man, loving that right there. What a jam! Nice. Oh, he got fancy with that one. Yeah, maybe trying to give them the momentum boost they need to break this game open. Closing in on four minutes played here in the second quarter. 11 feet away. That's tipped. Driving the lane, and he goes in for the dunk. Oh, rising and punching it on the young fella. You know. He loves having that much of a height advantage. Best chance to get yourself on the highlight reel. Brent, would you say the point guard is considered the toughest position to play in basketball? You know, Kevin, I think there's been a massive shift in what the point guard represents in the NBA game. I mean, how many teams over the past couple of years that have won championships have played with a traditional setup guard. What we're looking at is duos that can dribble, pass, and shoot and devastate defense. 
and they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. A different look for New York. Miracle Man who's checked in for Robinson. The Prophet comes in for Randall. And it's Josh Hart in for Jalen Brunson. Knicks trail by four. That's too hard. Who wants a t-shirt? And one more time. From past the arc, drills the three-pointer. Hart's got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. And he can hurt you from there. The D must be up on Hart when he has the ball. Here's the professor. Turn around Jay, and there's Virginia Beach with another bucket. Yeah, there's really no defense for that one. Turn around jumper, on time, on target. The three bridges, and again, New York with the triple. Yeah, there's six points on consecutive three balls. They're finding holes now in the deep. 52, 52. Pass to Milton. Good, nice job down low. Milton's got 14. Guys, he can't miss, I swear. He was trying to miss that. He did not miss. That means he can't miss. Miracle man, the pass to the prophet. And it's blocked. And it's out of bounds. The Knicks able to retain possession here. And right now, let's watch that terrific swat. And that is a huge block. Given how close this game is, a stop like that was right on point. On the wing, DiVincenzo. Defended by Milton. And he gets it to go, hitting off the back of the rim. Bridges has got the game tied up here for the Knicks. Virginia Beach has gotten off four shots from three-point range tonight and buried every... Oh! Yes, sir. 24. And guys, I don't know that this is the time for that kind of flair. <laughs> In a close game, the important thing is to get the two points, not necessarily the dramatics. Oh, come on. He had to go for that, <laughs> didn't he? My goodness. <laughs> New York moving it around. Here's Miracle Man, and he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. Now let's take a moment to get your guys' take on the scoring so far for Virginia Beach. Uh, they've been so aggressive, going strong at the defense, looking to score off of that penetration. Well, whether the defense is inviting these shots or not, they've been great in the mid-range, and so producing from there, that bodes well. On an OB, he's checked in for the Knicks. Jalen Brunson comes in for Bridges. Pass to Milton. Uses the glass to finish the lane. Milton's got 10 points now, just in this quarter. Well, he doesn't look satisfied with the lead right now. He wants more. He looks like he's going to get it. Here's the profit. Brunson scanning the floor. And an OB in the corner. Five to shoot. The shot's good from Brunson. Brunson's got 27 points. Oh, great move there from Jalen Brunson. Flashing. Over to the left wing. Stolen by Ananobi. In the corner, it's DiVincenzo. Pass to the Prophet. To the middle, here's Miracle Man. And trying for the go-ahead basket, it doesn't go in. Here's Milton driving to the basket. Oh, that's an old-fashioned rim rack. Uh, just a remarkable gem. These fans' jaws are on the ground right now. And so it's Brunson with it. He brings it up for the New York Knicks. They're getting their first look of the season at Virginia Beach in this one. Yeah, and they're hoping for a better showing against this club this season. Last year, they came out on the losing end. It's good. As much as you like Jalen Brunson, he believes in himself more than you do. Confidence translated. Brunson covering. Pass to the prodigy. And there's Virginia Beach with another bucket. Well, you like guys who can work that in-between area. Really keeps 
the defense. Oh, man, that is just easy for him out there. And his size with that kind of touch, that is money. And that's it for the first half of action. What's been a very close game here. Virginia Beach leads by only two. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks very much, Tibbs. Going against a high-powered offense like this, I know you have your work cut out for you at the defensive end. Yeah, you know, they're tough to guard. They put a lot of pressure on you. You can't make body position mistakes. We've got to make sure we try to make them work for the points. We'll see if you can be more effective in the second half. Thanks. Back to you guys. All right, thank you, David. And folks, don't go away after the break. We'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. When you look at how they're getting their points, a good portion comes from inside. They're going right at the defense. I like the aggressiveness. Don't lose steam in the second half. All right, fellas, time now to take a look at these early season standings in the East. Taking a look here now at Virginia Beach, this team wants to do big things, shack size things, and I gotta say, they're looking almost as dominant as Kenny. Easy, big fella, but I gotta say, they are making it look easy here in this early part of the season. That is more than enough of us. Let's send you back to the game. Kevin Harlan and crew with the second half. And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been fairly even so far. You know, Jalen Brunson has been exceptional here, guys. Wow. Yeah, it's been a great performance from him. Really staying focused on quality shots. Yeah, this is showing that they're not going to play at anybody else's pace but their own. Virginia Beach has gotten off four shots from three-point range tonight and buried every one of them. And Virginia Beach looking at who they've got. Here's the prodigy. Pass to Milton. Six on the shot clock. This one for three. Craps in the tray. He's got 22. Love his shot selection. Good at taking quality shots. Whether he's defended or open, he knows how to knock those down. Here's the Prophet on the wing, Di Vincenzo. Here's Miracle Man. That's him. That's his fifth field goal. He's shooting a hot 71%. Five for seven. Runs in covering. Second half rolling along now. About a minute played here. Pass to the Prodigy. Down low, Milton. Oh. oh! And that one is hammered home. Wow, and that sort of showmanship is just deflating right now to a team trying to get back into a game like this. Ouch, Greg, that is definitely an emphasis jam. A big apostrophe or exclamation point, maybe even a question mark. Here's Brunson. Oh, muscling it in, Brunson. We always hear about the toughness of Brunson. It really comes through when he's taking defenders on inside. GA, as you know, Jalen Brunson is a second generation NBA player. Yeah, his dad, Rick Brunson, was an 11 year vet who also played overseas and eventually settled in as a coach in this league. So Jalen grew up in those NBA locker rooms. Just over a minute and a half played here in the third. And they call the foul, so a chance at the line for one more coming up. Well, the talk at halftime must have been a good one right now. Three straight buckets to start the quarter. 
for Virginia Beach. They've been perfect so far from the free throw line. Six for six. And Tom Thibodeau decides to call timeout. He wants a minute here to get things straightened out with his team. Here is the 2K leader with the list of last season's top three-point shooters. Look at the profit. Second in the league. Extremely accurate from beyond the arc. And, of course, the professor. Same can be said about him. Another sniper will hurt you from three-point land. What shooting we saw from them all season. I mean, I'd love to see these guys in a game of course. They'd probably be draining shots from midcourt. Here's Brunson. A prodigy with the rebound. Solid rebound there. And with the score like it is, that's an area where they can't afford to get lazy. As to the professor... Finish it off, a uh, beauty. And everything is dropping for them. Terrific second half run. Well, with the confidence growing, that's one thing, but they seem to be getting more intense, and that's helping the quality of their play here. Miracle Man, the pass to the front. It's picked off. Runs in covering. And there's Virginia Beach with another bucket. At this point, I don't know what you can do to slow this team down. Well, nothing that they're doing seems to be making an impact. And there are some nights where you just run out of options, whether it's by personnel or by tactic. Takes it inside. Drives in. Brunson takes the hit. Maybe he's thinking at this point, man, somebody's got to help me. I can't do this all by myself. And he's got his first chance at the line here. And you, you know, something I remember from their last game was how good he was at the line. Jalen Brunson at the line. Brunson covering. He lobs it up. Stolen. And while we've got him on, I'd send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David? Hey, Kevin. As always with Tom Thibodeau's teams, they are level-headed. He said of his Knicks, we want guys to sacrifice and put the team first. But there has to be that belief. When your best players have it, your entire team ends up having it. We know if we stay disciplined, we'll have a chance to win. Kevin? A very good chance, D.A. Thank you. Here's Milton. Oh, just the contact and trying to throw a tap over the top. But instead, he'll shoot free throw. All stops the duck there. The best outcome in a bad situation. For Virginia Beach, they've gone a perfect 7 of 7 from the line tonight. All free throws good for Milton. Impeccable from the line since halftime. And an OB outside. Here's Miracle Man, and he goes strong with the one-handed jam. And an OB, a willing passer, a team player, wants to get that ball to his open guys. Runs in covering. Cloak loose. Here's the profit. He has six to the inside. Brunson. And there are the Knicks with another bucket. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats for the Knicks. All game long, they've had active hands and, and really out in the passing lanes. And that aggression on defense has resulted in a ton of steal. Uh, another part of the credit has to go to what they did on the inside blocking shots. I mean, super scrappy defensively and just affecting a lot of the opportunities that their opponents were putting up. Pretty easy right now. Clear out, give them some space, let them get to work. Here's Miracle Man. He's got 17. Pass to the Prophet. Now DiVincenzo. Defended by Milton. It's blocked. And it's out of bounds. Uh, last touch by Milton. And New York making a change. Bridges checks in. Number 25. Mikel Bridges. Shot clock at five. To the paint. Here's Ananobi. Can't hit the free throw line jump. And, the, and they're controlling the boards, Kevin. That's plus five in that category. Here's the professor. Had a hand on it. They get it back. Here's the prodigy. And there's Virginia Beach with another bucket. Fading away. He buries that one in traffic. Takes great body control to make that one go. 
Bridges outside. Pass to Brunson. Here's the profit. Fires for three, and the shot is good. The Virginia Beach lead has been cut to just five points in the basket from Brunson. He is just self-willing, his team right now, doing everything he can to keep them alive. Blocked on the way up, but hits it, and they call the blocking foul. And that's what he does. I mean, he is a bucket getter. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for Virginia Beach. You love how they lived in the paint, making the defense just consistently have to collapse and still finding ways to convert. You probably have to touch on as well that tonight their penetration has been awesome. I mean, they put force on this game, attacking off the bounce, and a willingness to do that has paid off. Miracle Man, the pass to Ananova. And here comes the break. And he's going up for the alley-oop. Pass to the Prophet. And he floats in for the easy two. Credit the assist on that one. Traditionally, that's how you want to finish the break. Right at the rim. Yeah, anything other than a layup in that situation, probably disappointing. Had numbers, took advantage. Here's the professor, defended by Bridges. Lock at six. He gets that one. 32 points in the game. He's played a huge role in this game to this point, but it looks like he just wants more. He wants to make sure that this lead holds up. Brunson kicks to Bridges. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. People talk about 3 and D with Bridges, but he can pass it too. So for the Knicks, Julius Randle's checked in for Miracle Man and Hart subbed in for Ananobi. Runs in covering. Pass to Milton. And so it looks like it'll be Virginia Beach's ball. And while we have a chance, let's take a look at the best free throw shooters in the league from last season. Take a look at the prodigy. Second in the NBA. Great from the line. And of course, a profit doing just as much. Also absolutely fantastic from the free throw line. And how about the work both of them put in from the foul line? Just such a consistent, dependable performance from both. Mitchell Robinson's checked in for New York. And that is first class right there. Can you believe that, Don? I'm not sure, Greg, I can. Brunson outside. And he gets the button. Brunson's got 15 points in just the second half. And not relying at all on the three-point shot. Uh, they may want to rethink about stretching the defense a bit like they did in that first half. Whistle blows. Bucket is good. And he'll have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. They are just killing him on the interior. For Virginia Beach, they haven't made a mistake at the line yet. 10 of 10. The Knicks making a switch here. Even Genzo's checked in. Knicks trail by eight. Brunson outside. Shot on the wing. Virginia Beach pulls it in. The Prodigy's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. And hard. Oh! oh He's going to put that one in his record. Insane dunk. And now they're starting to rub it in. Build up a lead, and here we go, baby. It is showtime. Brunson, no good. Out to the right wing. Pass to the Prodigy. Launches a three. Buries the long-range jumper. The Prodigy's got the lead up to 13 now for Virginia Beach. And it's Virginia Beach. 13 points up at the end of the period. They've been putting... And now we take a listen into the recent huddle from Tom Thibodeau. Everyone talking down there. Rebound and run. And one quarter to go in a game that to this point has not been an evenly fought contest. We've got Josh Harms. Dante DiVincenzo. He's out there with Mikel Bridges. Then it's the Prophet. And it's Randall in a power forward. That's the five for New York right now. Pass to the Prophet. Bridges kicks to DiVincenzo. Here's the Prophet. Intercepted. 
In transition, here comes Virginia Beach. Oh, they keep the ball out of the cylinder, but pick up a foul in the process. Two shots at the line. The first free throw is good. Number 33 at the line. Two shots. So he gets them both. Makes it pretty tough on the defense. Who are you going to pick to send to the free throw line? And he's hitting the free throws right now. Form looks good. Now here's DiVincenzo. He's guarded close. Here's Randall, and he gets contact and the whistle on the shot. Two shots coming up. At the line. Ah, the overall Two game shots. of Julius Randall is impressive. He's gritty. He is in there giving it Brent his everything. Yeah, Kevin, you think about that year where he averaged 24, 10 rebounds, and six assists. I mean, the only other guys that did that were Will Chamberlain, Oscar Robertson, Larry Bird, Russell Westbrook, Jokic, Giannis. All of those guys won MVPs. That's a heck of a list. And the basket is good. Yeah, Randall does a good job. His frame alone helps to create some space just with a little pivot there, able to find a way to score. Charity strike shot, and he nails the jump on. 37 points for him. Another good play. This is how they built the lead, calling on the right guys at the right time. Team basketball IQ is something that gets talked about, but it's importance to a team showing up here, running plays that turn into scores. DiVincenzo kicks to Hart. DiVincenzo passes to Hart, bangs home the trifecta. Hart just whipping it away quickly, not giving the defender time to close out. Defended by Bridges. Count that one. And yeah, he's not messing around. He wants no part of a comeback in this one. Well, he's grabbed a tee and a blanket because he's putting this one to bed. Randall outside. Bridges sets the screen for Randall. Shot clock at six. A profit. That's in. Coming off an assist from Randall. 14 points for the profit. Well, Randall, when he has the ball in his hands, aware that there might be an open teammate. That time he found it. Defended by Bridges. Pass to Milton. Foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. First yeah, good foul. job to take it right at the He throw good. Milton. OG Ananobi's checked in for Josh Hart. Two shots. No free throws good for Milton. And give them credit for the work they've done at the line. Nothing new. They're always impressive in terms of free throw shooting, but still worth mentioning. Let's go. Up again. Controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. And he has found the stroke, folks. Continues to knock down shot after shot. Perfection thus far. Oh, taking it to the rack with power. Hammering down the two-hand slam. Here's the profit. Pass to DiVincenzo. Now, Ananobi. And the Knicks hit again from deep. Well, and this has been their strategy throughout the fourth period. We'll see how it pans out. It's one thing to have teams shoot a bunch of threes, but with this team being that high defensively, you got to chase them away from anywhere near that line. Uh, with the finish line in sight, this guy is determined to be the one to put the game away. In transition, here comes Virginia Beach. Hammers it on to polish off the break. Pretty devastating, actually, to turn the ball over like that and, and surrender two more points. Pass to DiVincenzo. And the Knicks hit again from deep. And they're getting their points now almost exclusively from the triple. Four of their last five makes are from beyond the up. An amazing finish with a hand right in his face. 43 points in the game. And they're forcing the ball inside, and it's working like a charm. And an OB outside to the middle. And the shot is good. The Virginia Beach lead has been cut back down to 10 points after they get the bucket from DiVincenzo. Here's the professor. Defended by Bridges. 
Lost contact on the shot, and now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. I don't know what's happening defensively, but they're not putting up any resistance. More of the Knicks. Miracle Man comes in for Randall. And it's Jalen Brunson in for Bridges. And here's Brunson. He'll bring it up for the Knicks. And an OB in the corner. A shot's good on the assist by Brunson. Brunson's got four assists in the game. Here's the professor, defended by DiVincenzo. Out to the wing. Down low, stolen by Brunson. Pass to the Prophet. There's the triple. It's good for the seventh time this game. He's shot seven. He has made seven. And perimeter scoring, I have to imagine it was a topic of discussion at halftime. Maybe trying to find a little bit more space and ball movement to get guys open at the three-point line. Brunson outside. Plays it up and banks it in. Now just a five-point Virginia Beach lead. Oh, huge moment from J.B. Brunson knocking it down. Pulls it from the elbow. Count that bucket. And that's just cold-blooded right there. He's taking no prisoners. Confidence is sensational, and it feels like no one is going to stop him tonight from scoring. And the timeout called here by Tom Thibodeau. Clearly, he's got something his players need to hear. And immediately. And with an update from the sidelines, let's check in with David Aldridge. Thanks, guys. I listened to Tom Thibodeau talking to his team during the break. They were asking the team to play faster, push the ball. Coach told their players, hey, look, in this league, fast break points are the easiest. We need more of them. You can't argue with that. Kevin? All right, David, thanks. That one falls. And he lives for the moment. Wants him playing his best during punch time. There's another ball. Making his presence felt on this end. He's holding down the fort, anchoring the defense. The professor passes to Milton. Four on the shot clock. Shoots over Ananobi. And there's Virginia Beach with another bucket. Not surprised at all. He's shooting it well and scoring points in bunches. Brunson outside. Takes the 13-footer. Good, he hits again. My goodness. 50 for the game. Yep, he is putting on a show. Here's the professor, defended by DiVincenzo. Here's the profit. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Wow, wow, he got whacked. Oh, that one shouldn't be much debate there. Good on the first, and that shrinks the margin to just four. Two shots. He's perfect from the line this time. He's the one person that the coaching staff and the teammates love to see at the line in a tight ball game. You can pretty much bank on these. Hits it again. Wow. My goodness. 50 for the game. Yep, he is putting on a show. On deep, Brunson. Pass to DiVincenzo. Ananobi with it. Brunson outside. Yet another bucket. And he's up to 52 points. Yeah, making a GA look all too easy right now. And Brunson's got the mindset to deliver. Good, that's another bucket. And he's up to 52 points. Yeah, making a GA look all too easy right now. Time call here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. They trail by five. Talking here to our analysts, what factors, guys, come to your mind? They're trying to get back in this thing. They need a score. It's funny, at this point in the game, the coach is asking the team to be perfect. They haven't been to this point. 
Ananobi passes to Brunson. I'm open right here. It counts. What a beautiful shot to bring him to within three. Showing time and time again, he is comfortable being that first option. Brunson delivering in the clutch. Had to foul, and on that occasion to stop the clock. That's the enemy in this situation. And so they choose to intentionally foul. He hits the first one, and that gives them a four-point cushion. Two shots. And so both free throws are good, and it's a five-point game. Ooh, I think that's a wrap, and I can tell you, you can't have more pressure-packed free throws than the ones that are going to seal the game. And out of bounds, Virginia Beach will have it. You gotta love strong defense, especially when it comes in the form of harsh rejections. Wow. Sharp instincts on D there. Just timing. When to rise up and swat that one away. Five seconds left in the fourth. And now we've got the intentional foul. Fourth personal foul. Team is in the penalty. He drops the first one, and that increases their lead to six. Two shots. And so he drops them both. It's a seven-point game. Virginia Beach picking up the win. They That's seem to relish their role as the bad guy here tonight. Yeah, you know, Kevin, I sense that as well. I mean, they really did feed off all of that negative energy this crowd was directing at them. I mean, they turned it around and used it as motivation to close out a significant win. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Brett Berry, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan along with our 2K Sports crew. And now, our player of the game.